Cursor AI just got a major upgrade. It can now read, modify, and interact with Figma designs automatically. With the help of an open source MCP plugin, you can programmatically adjust UI elements inside Figma without manually tweaking each component. Let's set it up and see how it works. To get started, you need to install Bun, a lightweight JavaScript runtime. Once that's done, the setup process will install the MCP integration directly into your cursor project. Next, you'll start a WebSocket server, which acts as the bridge between cursor and Figma. After that, you'll configure cursor to recognize the Figma integration by adding a few lines to its settings. Once everything is set up, launching the WebSocket server will establish a direct connection, allowing cursor to communicate with Figma in real time. Now let's bring Figma into the mix. Inside Figma, you'll go to the plugins section and create a new development plugin. Instead of building one from scratch, you'll link an existing plugin by selecting its configuration file. Once that's done, the plugin will appear in your list of development tools, ready to interact with Cursor. Now that everything is connected, Cursor can programmatically modify UI components inside Figma. It can retrieve detailed information about an entire project, identify selected elements, and even make structural modifications. This means you can create new shapes, add text elements, change colors, and adjust layouts, all through AI commands instead of manual edits. Cursor can also export components as images, manage design components efficiently, and even execute custom JavaScript inside Figma, making it one of the most powerful automation tools for UI design. With this integration, AI can now assist in automating UI development, allowing for faster, more efficient design workflows. Could AI-powered UI automation be the next big shift in design? Let me know what you think in the comments. And if you found this interesting like subscribe and hit the bell for more AI-powered development updates.